Welcome back to The Merge, the wrestling guide for jiu-jitsu. Leandro Loa wins his eighth world title this year in his finals match against Izaki Bayans. He strategically times his double leg using both collar grips. All right, so when it comes to the gi, it's a little bit easier to, to defend takedowns, right? Below the waist, double leg, single leg, etc. cetera, um, because we have the grips now, right? So our opponent sometimes can grab collar sleeve, or sometimes you're going more like double collars. And if they're just, if their goal is straightening their arms, kind of preventing us from taking them down, they know we're going for a takedown, this is hard for me, right? And if I just take these shots, look, he's just gonna straight arm me away. I can just take a couple penetration stops here, and this is what's gonna happen to me, okay? So, we could, of course, try and break these grips, or Leandro could try and break these grips, but sometimes grip fighting or, grip, or, or breaking these grips can uh, open up another grip for your opponent, or can obviously bring your posture up where they can take a shot now. So, Leandro's just gonna wait, right? He's patiently waiting, strategically waiting for this double A, because look, he has what he wants already. He has, these two collar grips himself as well. So now they're kind of at a stalemate, right? Two collar grips versus two collar grips. He's gonna wait it out. So he's waiting for Izaki to move his, uh, move his grip. So Izaki actually does let go and move his grip, but he goes down to Leandro's sleeve. Leandro's not gonna shoot yet, right? Because Leandro goes to shoot, stiff arm, stiff arm, here. Kind of the same scenario, he's controlling that arm now. So once Izaki moves from his sleeve over the back, he tries to make a grip here. This is when Leandro's opening's up. This is when the opening happens, okay? Because now, it's one arm pushing into my chest versus two of his arms pulling him forward, okay? This arm is no longer doing anything. It's not, it's not in the way of Leandro anymore, okay? So what Leandro's gonna do is he's gonna take this double leg, but notice when he takes the double leg, look at Izaki's feet. They come forward, both of them come forward due to the hard pull that Leandro's doing, okay? So this setup is, is just beautiful, it's perfect with the Guion, okay? He's simply lowering his level, and as he lowers his level and hits his knee, he's pulling. So watch my partner's feet here. See how they're both, the he's meeting me. I'm not just dropping to him. I'm pulling him in and we're meeting in the middle. So Leandro's pulling, pulling him forward, dropping down to the knee, into the double leg. Here. From here, Leandro's stepping up that trail leg, running the double leg to score to two points. All right, so run through this one more time. His opponent has double collar grips, so does Leandro, right? Instead of breaking grips and trying to grip fight, Leandro's gonna wait for that perfect opportunity. He's gonna wait for his opponent to break one of the grips so he has that opening, okay? Zaki winds up reaching over the back to try and get a grip up top. Now it's two arms versus one, okay? As he lowers the level for the double leg, he's pulling, right? He's pulling up and towards him to get his feet hopping forward so he meets him halfway to enter the double leg. Runs the double leg backwards, scores the two points. Thanks for tuning back into the Merge. For more episodes, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and I'll see you guys next time.